Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. I'm Argent Leo, and today we continue with Tokiden 2. Okay, so the last time we were standing on this bridge, so. Morohobi Hills, Morohoba Road. Okay, so we. I think we're in the right. We're in the right place. Hunter of Wild Plants. Hey, I haven't seen you around before. Ah, you're the one the professor brought in. She found him in lying out there in the wild. Hunter of the wild plants. You've come from quite far away, so I hear. I guess that means you don't know much about the local terrain. The area is called the Morohaba, Morohaba Hills. They are still only here, but it's safer than a lot of other places. That's thanks to the rocky mountains surrounding the area and the slayers from the village. They're more barbaric than the only <laughs> wild bunch. Hunter of the wild plants. Villagers like myself can't thank them enough. If you like, I can go into a little more detail. Is there anything in particular you would like to ask? No. <laughs> is that so? Yes, that is so. <laughs> if you do want to ask anything, just come and find me. Okay. I've been walking these hills for 20 years, so there's nothing I don't know about them. You're going to slow down the progression of my story. Yes, the man. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. I have to do this. I decided that I was going to take the shortcut today. Just go to the edge and then take one more step forward. That's all. I'll be at the bottom of the cliff before I know it. Hmm? No. Can't. I'm too scared. Oh! Okay. <laughs> I wasn't actually going to do that, but it seemed like he wanted to commit... Something very terrible. Okay. Damn it, you piece of junk. Hello. This is the professor. Can you hear me, Slayer? Good. We're connected. Finally got it working. Hey, did you surprise me? Oh, did I surprise you? I'm using the communicator that attached to the demon hand. Another genius invention bringing telepathy to the masses without having to really rely on a maiden. This is what I meant about catching up with you later. Oh, okay. You're in the middle of your right of truth, correct? That's correct. Hunting some some imps and collecting materials, a simple mission. Get it over with, quickly. She's worried. The Watcher's outpost, your final destination, is far to the west. Check on the map, be sure. Why am I not... oh. Healing... Healing plus X, okay. Ritual purification R1. Okay. Okay. R3. A special ability of Slayers. It draws a Aku to offer a boost in a boost of speed. It consumes focus for a long for as long as it's active. You know, I have no idea what half these things. Okay, now I'm fighting the Oni. If those... <laughs> which, which button do I use? Why am I... Okay, stop running. Focus. Swing big sword. Use demon arm. Okay, I'm just gonna press these two buttons together. I, I don't like this focus thing because I'm really... Okay. But then again, you know the, the bushes and shrubs. Oh wow, we grab all of those. Ritual purification. Why is this so tough? Okay. 
Proficiency, developing boost, proficiency attack, and only while using might. Boost growth requirements. Boost becomes more effective as you gain proficiency with them. You can develop posts. You can develop boosts by attacking the Oni, defeating the Oni, or performing the ritual purification. You know. I don't know what many of these things mean. I know where the demon end is. <laughs> and where my punch button is. Oh, something happened. Oh, those those things are mean looking things. Ooh, they got bad breath. Dude. Okay, there's his punch button. There's his small punch button. Keep beating them before they, they have a chance to strike back. Okay, that's like a power up. Oh, that, that. He really didn't like that. Okay, that helps. Okay, ritual purification. I'm starting to understand it now. It feeds um, those guys. Dude, they like way past you. <laughs> Okay, it, feel, it feels my Haku. I think it's called <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, that was a good one. Okay, so I just go around like a vampire and collect all these things. Okay, so that's one of the marks. I need to go up this way towards that mark. Oh, so that's like... Wait, map. Marahabu... Marahabu village is there. My map's not really telling me what I need to do. <laughs> okay, I just... We'll just move around and see what he do what he does. Okay, these are special chests placed across the island for slayers to give unneeded equipment to other slayers. Place equipment in an empty reliquary to have it delivered to another slayer. Okay, re reliquary basically means you relinquish your stuff and someone else relinquishes your stuff. Okay, enough, enough of that. It's it's not something we want to do. Okay, so I know where that chest is and there's another green thingy. Oh. I think the green thing is at least this. Big, big finish. Big, big, big finish. <laughs> oh, he's still around. Okay, let's let's eat them. Kawara Tota, Kokoniari. Oh, that guy's happy. Skill acquired. Hardened only bone and one iron ore. Okay, I guess I need to go north. Okay, there's something here. Maybe I just stay here until until they call me back. Yeah. 
this thing is more like transportation. It doesn't. It doesn't seem to to damage the Oni. Oh, there's a traveler there. Can I help him? Man, holding his breath. Okay. He did. Don't talk to me. I'm pretending to be dead. <laughs> I'm not actually dead. Just leave me alone. <laughs> the only I finally moved on. Ah. One thing. Don't touch the, the grotto over there. Promise. Promise me. I'm going to touch it. A group of Oni has appeared. Oh, wow. Oh, I, oh these these guys. Roll, jump, dive. Whoa, I, I, I really put my foot in it. It doesn't like you have a decent roll. Ooh. I don't like that. So, like, like with the... Oh, wow! Let's, let's fight the weak ones first then. And if I am letting something... Okay, I, I think he's in... Okay, I think that one's down. You know, there's a delay between these strikes. Or maybe I haven't got out to the timing right, but... They kind of kill him when he does this. <laughs> they don't even seem sometimes to be even bothered about what I'm doing. Okay, I got that one. Angles up, but okay. Oh wow! That did not deflect. <laughs> oh! I I sh I should stop touching that wall. I need to get them actually away from the wall. I come this side. Oh wow! Too close to the wall. Oh! He, he blocked that thing. Okay, let's purify them and not touch that wall anymore. It's just one, so... Okay. And we purify this... Oh, this guy. 
<laughs> what you went and did it anyway i guess i'm not one to talk anyway okay he touched it before anyway thank you for defending that menace oh thank you for defeating that menace now i can head back to the village no need to worry about me i can make it back alone once my legs stop shaking okay so Okay, let me bust these guys for him. I'm trying to see if... Um if my energy level increases when I do that, and it, I don't know, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, so I'm going... <laughs> okay. Thought he was gonna... he was doing something. That's the O button. Spider Web Woman. Whoa! That's a big one. What? Sorry, I'm talking about that spider web. Oh, okay. Can't you see it? There, beyond the cliff? I'd love to just tear it down. I bet that would feel great. It's too big for that though, isn't it? You can just sweep away normal spider webs with your hand. That one though is far too big to handle like that i wonder if there's another way to get rid of it okay i guess let's jump up like to jump up yes i'm fighting all of these Block it. <laughs> so to block. Just try and stay out of the direct attack. I can get them all in front of me. Get out! <laughs> okay. If, if, if they're like that. Oh man. And you know I don't I don't understand what he's saying. If I could understand what he's saying at that moment when he's allowing them to strike him down. That was a lot. Okay, maybe there's health in that. Just wait, let me. Toxic Fang. Let's see if that does something. No. Okay, that that just brings down that. Yeah, that that makes my scenery go away. Okay. Wait, wait, wait! He targeted now. Okay, nice. Oh yes, I remember there is a target feature. Okay, I think I got the hang of the fighting now. <laughs> Is he tends to do his own thing now and then. Okay, there's something I need to collect here. 
You obtain the ceremonial gloves. Store store this equipment in your requery. No, not yet. Akrik Woods is sinking to defeat. I don't know what this means. Is gone. Is okay. The only way for a snake to protect the light from another arc is sinking to defeat. Is gone. The giant. Okay, well, it's a fragment. Okay. Inscriptions, relics that contain a written record of past civilizations are scattered throughout the, throughout the land. Touching them causes you to visualize the strange symbols forming these ancient writings. Okay. Take some of my square button. Now you take some of my triangle. Oh, they, they don't like you to... Am I going the right way? Okay, definitely not. Okay, I, I suppose it's fine that there's other motions like to move, like you got the demon hand and you got the roll. But I hate that there's no jump. Even, even if jump has got no particular feature in the game, I just... It's... It's just fun to have a jump button. Something there. The right of truth. Okay, good. You finished every objective. Now head for the watches outpost in the west. <laughs> Be careful. I'm ending the communication here. Okay, so she's not going to talk to us anymore. West, north, south. Okay. Westward is the way that the arrow. Is pointing on the map. Okay, this seems like. Okay, crests. These gold colored Slayer crests can be found floating in the air at hidden locations throughout the land. It is said that a, that a person who finds them all will receive good luck. Okay. Oh, nice. It's so good that they're all here to, to greet me. It must be like a novelty to have a, a Slayer return alive. Okay, Morahoba Hills watches post. Let's speak to... Let's speak to her. I've been waiting for you, Slayer. How are you? How are things going? Benizuki, you've completed all the objectives. Well done. I think that was too simple for you. Great th Okay, this is Tokitsuku. Great, this makes you a slayer. You're getting ahead of yourself, Pupsqueak. Homura. Homura. Tokusiku. Who's the Pupsqueak, weirdo? You have realized it, right? That you're surrounded? What? <laughs> huh? Of course! Benizuki, Slayer, this is your final test. 
Fight alongside me and defeat all of these only. Sure thing, Benizuki. Let's. No, the, wait, okay, that's the aim, aim one. What is, what is that? Did she do that? No, she got skills. Oh, Benny Suki knows all the button layout. <laughs> My character every now and then takes a breather. <laughs> She's like just relentless. What is there? Okay. I'll do better. I, I don't know. I wasn't concentrating what was written on the screen. My camera was sh was shaking because it's mounted on my desk. <laughs> okay, that was exciting. Is anyone hurt? Please, not from a skirmish like this. Aha! I saw you about to get bitten on the rump. <laughs> That's his bump. You won, right? That's all that matters. You've still got a lot to learn, Omoru. Mora. Slayer, what about you? No problems. What about you? No problems. Benizuki, glad you ate. Slayer, you completed that mission with skill. No one will be able to deny you a place as a village slayer after I report these results. So he did quite well. As your examiner, I have the authority to now state you have passed your right of truth. From this moment forward, you are officially a slayer of our village. Welcome to Moro. Moroba. <laughs> yes, well done, slayer. You've taken the first step. Keep it up. This is all such a hassle. Someone as strong as you should be a slayer from the start. It actually gave us a compliment. Sometimes a certain level of procedure is required in order to convince everyone. I will report your HQ. You should be able to take any mission you want from now on. Anyway, I'm still concerned about the movements of the Oni. For today, let's continue to patrol this region. Benisuki was impressed. This place gets pretty cold. We're close to the other world. That's why it's cold in there, regardless of the season. You can sense the cold, even in that body. Would you think, who do you think you're talking to? This is a custom bolt. All five senses working to one degree or another. Okay, shame. It's actually, it's, it's not nice that uh, Omuru, you know, tells Tokusuku nonsense like that. One degree or another, huh? Slayer? You're a distant relative of the professor, right? From a village far to the east. However, the entire Midlands are currently on the verge of collapse. I can't believe any village would just allow one as strong as you to simply walk away. He wasn't. He was cast out by the Oni. You can share the truth with me. The reason why you came to Morobo. Tell about Yokohama. Say nothing. Tell about Yokohama. From Yokohama? To be completely honest, none of us know. The only thing we do know is that our new friend here 
was fighting in Yokohama until not so long ago. <laughs> a battle that the professor said was the, the defense of Yokohama, which took place during the awakening 10 years ago. In other words, someone has in other words, someone has done more than cross the country. They've crossed time itself. Uh, they, they are shocked. Aha! Ha, uh, ha, 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 you're joking. This is no joke. Knocked out of Yokohama, woke up in <laughs> That's a nice way of saying it. <laughs> you can throw a little amnesia into the mix too. No memory is from before Yokohama. Shame. Benizuki, my apologies for prying. I had no idea things were quite so convoluted do you have any other clues we know that kuyo grand general of the holy mount was leading the operation at yokohama but still he isn't someone we can meet easily following up on the lead on that lead we'll have to wait i see this means you don't know what has been happening in the world since the awakening. Well, it's all gone to crap. Then I can at least tell you that. The awakening 10 years ago caused the epic shift in the world, in this world. Only have overrun everything and the majority of humanity have been killed. The Meiji government collapsed, and now the Slayers are the only governmental body. Based at the Holy Mount, they protect what remains of humanity along with the few remaining villages. This region in which people still live is what we call the Midlands. Is there anything else you want to ask about the cause of the awakening? The facts about your karma, about the slayers, nothing in particular. Okay, what is the actual cause of the awakening? That, I'm afraid, we still don't know. <laughs> okay. A massive Oni gate suddenly opened in the north. The Oni followed out. Um, the Oni flowed out from it. The first major battle to hold them back was the defense of Yokohama, of which you have some first-hand knowledge. Is there anything else you want to ask about? Nah, let's continue with the story. That's everything that happened during the 10 years. I know it was probably difficult to hear. Was it though? Homura? Nothing is truly over. So long as you are still alive. Okay. As long as you're still alive, still got a fighting chance. The fight goes on. Even 10 years later, they. You're probably basically still in your karma. Okay. You lost your memory? Great. Think of it as an opportunity. A chance to start over. Everything is good if you win in the end. The harder a fight is, the more fun it is to fight. You agree, right? I can't just start over easily. You might be right. We'll win. We'll win so it doesn't matter. Let's just agree with you for now. <laughs> I know I'm right. So, keep on fighting. Benizuki. You suck at cheering people up, Omura. Hey. I'm... Um, hey, I'm not trying to cheer anyone. <laughs> you could try being honest every now and then. <laughs> You're wrong, though. Now you're a slayer for our village. This is the start of your battle with the Oni. Will you fight alongside us, slayer? Got nothing better to do. 
Thank you. In which case, I'm off to bed. You put the fire out, newcomer. Amora, everyone is equally worn out. You tidy this place up as punishment for not taking things seriously enough. What? I didn't do anything. You're going to play innocent with me? <laughs> Maybe that will teach you. Tokuzuku, you help him. <laughs> it's too dangerous for him to do it alone. What? <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Looks like you're gloating too soon. <laughs> Fundamentals of the Slayer. Return to Mohorobo. Mohoro. Right. Let's head back to the village. Are you ready to set out? Before we do, I've got something for the two of you. Something from the from the professor. Demon hands? For us? Apparently more test subjects will make things go faster. She told me to hand them over after the right of truth. It's not going to explode again, is it? There's nothing to worry about. You've been using them without any problems. See? Come on. Get them on. Don't say anything, Slay. <laughs> okay. This is the demon end. Doesn't look like much of much to me. Good morning, friends. Oh, now she can. Now she's she got a link to everybody. Well, where did that voice come from? Inside your head. It's me. I'm calling you through the demon end, <clears throat> Professor. I can do this too. Looks like everyone has received their demon hands. I welcome more users. Use the hands as much as you can. That will help me research. That will, that will help my research advance. Slayer, you tell them both now to use it. I should also mention that it will explode if you try to forcibly remove it. Yeah. with care. Oh, we're not. <laughs> I, th I think she's joking. Tokusuki, Slayer, what's this talk about exploding? Don't get upset. There's a lot. There's all sorts of reasons behind this. <laughs> Benizuki and Umoro can now be included in your party. Right then. Slayer's orders. Slayer's fundamentals. Okay, they'll appear on the map. Right then. Let's head back to the village. There's still a, a number of things I want to share with you. The fundamentals of a slayer. Touch a portal stone and you can move to a different portal stone. You can make use of them when, for instance, returning to the village. Command icon. These things are so confusing. These allow you to give commands to your allies. You can switch between party members by pressing R1 or L1. You can order them to attack, aid others, roam freely, or follow your lead. Okay, so now it becomes like a sort of like a Final Fantasy thing. I think I mentioned, said something similar to that in my last video. Okay. Let's head out to the village, which is in that direction. Okay, so I think they on auto fight. Yep. And so they basically on auto protect. <laughs> and okay. A demon hand technique that utilizes the geo pluses, geo pulses, 
Housing different elements, you can press square to release them and triangle to, aff to affix them to your weapon. Geo pulses you use will respawn after a short period of time. Geo pulses. I. Well, I suppose, like, once I get further into the game, I'm not sure if all the buttons are now active. You know, all the functions are now active, but I'm sure as I get a little bit more, go a little bit more deeper into the game, I suppose I'll understand it more. Well, the fighting. So far, we just know that we're destroying Oni. And, you know, I think I can, like, just basically just walk and they, they're going to do all the work for me. Skill acquired. Oh, nice. So basically, my work has become a lot easier now. <laughs> so rude. Grabbing, grabbing only out of. Just gonna grab one for myself. Okay, so I grabbed him and they destroyed him. What is that? Something... Something's here. Why don't they pick these things up? They... They're doing everything. You see, that's what I... I hate that it can't... Uh, hello, villager. What's up? I've noticed something strange. So this is Natsumi. Astro astrologer. I noticed something strange. Maybe you can have... You have two. This light in the sky. I've never... I haven't looked up. Eh? To be honest with you, I've not looked up. No matter. How much time passes, it doesn't change position. Yet, morning comes, followed by afternoon. Dusk falls, and then the curtain of night. The rhythm of the sky remain intact, but there's something wrong with that light. Something that looks like the sun, but isn't. Something pretending to be the moon. I will continue my observation of from here in order to determine the truth. I have no idea what she's, what she's on about, but anyway, we're going this way. What is that? Oh, right. Okay, now I, I now have to, uh, how to do that, but... Okay, that's what I was looking for. And I don't know why that symbol is... is there. Probably for directions. Okay, villager. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about this. Suspicious man. If you were a slayer of Mor Mohoroba, I might have a request for you. You haven't proven yourself yet. You know what, dude? Keep your opinion to yourself. Uh... Okay, that's... Can I climb this? Uh, 
Ok. I think we're back. Okay, guard. Fortress soldier. There has been an only attack. Everyone is on high alert. Okay. So we're at the fortress. Can we enter the fortress? No. Oh. And he can't jump, so... There's no going up there. Are they fighting somebody? Okay, let's try and get back to the village. So we're actually going the right way. Um, okay. Man praying to the statue. That roadside statue looks a bit odd, doesn't it? You agree? It almost looks like the left statue was damaged while protecting the right statue. <laughs> why? Why do you think that is? Why do I think that is? I don't, don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to answer that guy. <laughs> Well, it's actually nice having having the team. Like wh when I was fighting the monsters on my own, I was wishing for the team. But now they they sort of hogging all the glory. Okay, Morahoba Hills, Morahoba Road. Okay, so at least we're on the right path now. This is what is that? It's a mystery. <laughs> oh, I must go this way. Lead them astray. Let them fight while I run home. This is interesting. Okay, found a crescent more by hills. Okay, those are the hidden things. Who's this guy? Tsuzuki hidden brother. <laughs> hidden brother. Um, it is not yet time. Prove yourself as a slayer of Marhoba. Then come and see me again. Okay, so he's going to make this game a little bit more complicating and maybe a bit interest more interesting. So many villages. Inventory worker, huh? What can I do? My foot hurts too much. I can't move. Why am I so clumsy? We, we don't know. <laughs> oh, that guy was jumping. Okay, we're going the right way. Okay, Morahaba Village. Your items have been delivered to your chest. Okay, it automatically goes there. Nice. If 
Professor, welcome back, friends. Professor, it's rare to see you in the HQ. I'm here to celebrate the promotion of my assistant. Slayer, you've successfully become a slayer. <laughs> For this village. Impressive. There's clearly a reason why you were fighting Yokohama. I've got something for you. A gift? I'm not sure I can take any more gifts from you. Don't worry. This is a nice one. Oh, okay. He's talking about uh, putting him into that bottle and stuff. Okay. I actually I actually feel sorry for Toko Sik Toku for, for for Tiki because of his his situation. It shows a bit of resentment towards the professor. I'm not sure. Uh, uh, well, maybe later on in the, in the story we'll actually figure out his real true emotions and how he feels about the whole situation. Professor, I'm expanding the functions of the demon hand. Having you use the demon hand has allowed me to progress faster than expected with my research. I found a way to draw out the latent power of the Mitsum Mitama. I call it an in an evasion skill. Remaining time, evasion skill name, immortal. Evasion skills are special powers that extract from the Mitama with a slayer's armor. The effects are triggered when certain conditions are met. Their cooldown is reduced if you attack. If you are attacked. Okay. Benizuki, a bit on the nose, don't you think? Fessa, think of it as a Mitama skill that focuses on defense. The demon hand senses the will of the Mitama and reactively activates it in order to protect the user. Auto shield! If you have some Mitama set to your equipment, it will then work when you need it. Seeing you have access to multiple Mitama, you may as well make use of them. Here, put out your hand. I will explain the functionality of your demon hand. Okay. <laughs> Receive damage from the enemy. It reduces damage received for a limited time. This, this game has got a lot. Okay, so I'm busy paging through it. This game, this this game has got a lot to learn. <laughs> reduces damage received for limited time. Oh, okay. Okay, confirm. Okay, this is the new only at Atsu. I'll do my best. Okay. Um, summons an Oni that serves as your doppelganger for a limited time. Oni that touch the doppelganger create. An explosion that damages any nearby enemies and knocks them back. Okay, that's that's a cool power to have. I've got three. Oh, nice. Okay. Alright, that should do it. Access to an invasion skill will aid you with fighting an Oni. Use the power and keep on with the experiment. If this goes well, I'll hopefully... If this goes well, I'll hopefully be able to draw more power from Mitama in the future. Everyone else, come on. Let's set up the same thing for you. Hey, are you sure about this? Success is built on failures, right? Why, why? This is a little yeah, better than simple. human experimentation. You can now use evasion skill. 
But ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me. I'm Argent Leo. We've been playing Tokiden 2, Free Alliances version. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do enjoy the content of this channel, please do consider subscribing. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care.